Hey guys, it's Coach, and I just wanted to say thanks again for, for everything. Um, this last four years have been um, some of the most amazing times in my entire life, and I cannot thank you enough. I'll be forever indebted for the things that this has taught me and given me, for what you boys and you alumni, your parents, your families um, have given me. And I just wish all of us the best as we go forward into a new season. You know, our seniors, Arthur and Connor and Cade and, and Nate, I wish you the best going forward. Uh, I'm hopeful that this locker room will once again see Caden and, and Kiefer and Trey um, put on uniforms and walk out of here to play. But I just wish everybody the best going forward um, in, in whatever new season of life that, that we're headed into. And I want you to remember something about culture. Um, culture is not based off of or, or produced by championships and trophies and wins. It's produced by high expectations and what you believe. And that's what has driven the culture of this soccer program to be so strong because every year we've set extremely high expectations, so high people call us crazy, so high they scare us to death. And at the same time, we believe that we can do all things. We believe that, that we can get there. We have that belief, and so just remember that through your, your culture will always stay strong if you continue to set high expectations and you continue to believe. Because when you do those two things, that drives your behavior. And then your behaviors create habits. And those habits are the things that you guys already have that are making you champions on the field and off the field, no matter how the year goes with your, your, your win-loss record. So don't forget that. I just want to, as I was checking out today um, at school, something kind of hit me about relationships. And, and not that they're bad at this school or, or anywhere else, but, you know, when we're checking out and, and people are saying, you know, good luck, um, have fun in the mountains and all this, and, and I'm saying, we'll see you and, and um, goodbye, and it was nice knowing you, and all that kind of stuff, and it, 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 again, it's not bad, and, and it was sincere, but I just started to think, are all these relationships really authentic? You know, because without social media, I probably will never see or hear or have any contact with a lot of those people ever again. And it just made me realize and appreciate the authenticity and the realness of the relationships in this family. And I think that is what has been the most important thing to me and it is the most valuable thing that comes out of this locker room and out of this program. It's those relationships that are here um, you guys are really like family to me. And so I, I want you to remember this one thing going forward, and this is for parents, alumni, players. Parents, show this to your kids so they can see it. Is that one thing I've always stressed here is that we're not measured by what we get. It doesn't really matter what our talents, our abilities, and our gifts bring to us. The world measures us like that, but that's not really how we're measured. We're measured by how often we give away our talents and our abilities and our gifts. You guys are only going to be champions if what makes you a champion you give away. So please, all those things that you're coming into and you're realizing about yourself and you're developing, don't keep them for you. It's, it's not about you. Give them away. That's where you'll find your purpose and that's where you'll leave a legacy. And so again, I just want to thank you this has been amazing. Um, I will see you again because, like I was talking about, those authentic relationships, you know, that, that, that are in this locker room, and so many of our relationships that we have in, in business and in, in our, our work and, and our friends. Again, I, I think how really authentic and real are those relationships? Here, the relationships are real. It's like our real blood family. No matter how far you want to run away from some of them, they're still there. They're still family. And so I consider you guys, honestly, my family. And I love every single one of you. And so it's not goodbye. I'll be back. I'll be following you. I can't wait to come watch you guys play and watch you guys do great things on the field and off the field. And I'm going to stay in touch. And I mean that. Because authentic relationships 
produce that. And so it's not goodbye, guys. It's just see you when I see you. And that's a wrap with me and Sepulpa Soccer. I love you guys. Talk to you later.